If you're aspiring for success in any area, business, sport, anything, it's important to dream about it, visualize it, work at it, do all of these things. But don't get lost so much in the future goals that you forget to enjoy the moment. Hey, welcome back. Jeff Hagee, Daily Success Strategies. Thanks for being with me today. So recently, we, we're in March Madness. We're watching a lot of basketball. I've got a lot of memories popping up on Facebook from different things that have happened in the past, from coaching my daughter, from coaching different teams. And it's really made me reflect on a few things. And as I've talked about in other episodes, um, I just finished reading the book, The Tale of Sport by Duff Gibson. Great book, and it made me reflect on a few things. And what I want to advise is whether you're looking at it from an athletic standpoint, from a business standpoint, whatever you're trying to be successful at, you can't reach an elite level. You can't be great at what you're doing without putting in the work, without putting in the dreaming, without the visualization, without doing all the things, all the things that everyone does to get there. But as we do those things, don't forget about the journey and the importance of that part of it. You know, I as I reflect on my experience with coaching my daughter for so many years, from a young age all the way up to her senior year, the journey, at least for me, was incredible. You know, there's so many accomplishments we had. There's so many specific games that were great. You know, the night that she scored her thousandth point, um, you know, making playoffs, you know, the night she scored 47 points. There's so many specific games that I can point out that were such great achievements, that such great memories and all that. But you know what? The 5 a.m. practice of just her and I, the times that we're at the park just shooting, the times that she's on the track training, there's so many of those different things that along the way were as important or more important to me now than any of those other memories. And yeah, there's a point that you're gonna get to either reaching that goal or not, and it's over. But you're gonna be reflecting on what got you there forever. And you know, I wanna read something actually from Duff Gibson in his book. He says, strive for the top, absolutely. Dream about it, do what it takes, work hard at improving mentally and physically, but also realize that just by trying to improve and trying to be the best, you experience something you'll look back on with great reverie. Not everyone has the privilege of dedicating themselves to a singular purpose. Don't let the fact that only a few ever reach the top interfere with what a wonderful journey it can be. So think about it, whether, like I said, whether it's a sport, whether it's business, whatever it is, do everything you can to be the best, reach for the top, do everything you can to maximize your potential, but don't look past the experience you're having and getting there. You know, I, I've talked about it with the teams I've coached as much as you might not like the conditioning part, there is a day you'll look back and say, you know what? I wish I could be there doing that again whether it's the friendships, whether it's the experiences, whatever. Don't miss that part in business, in sports. You know, there's a lot of things I look back on in my companies that I got to meet some incredible people. Some for a short period in my life. Some have stayed in my life for a long period, which is awesome. But I've had different experiences. I've gone different places and I've met some incredible people. I look at my rodeo career. I got to spend a lot of time with my brother because we were both doing the same thing and traveling together. I got to go to a lot of places. I got to do a lot of things and meet a lot of people that I otherwise would have never done. So make sure to appreciate the moment. All right, hopefully that's something that'll help you kind of focus on making sure you're doing the right things, but still keep after your goals. Don't let that distract you from your goals. You still gotta do all the things you need to work hard and do everything you need to achieve those goals, but enjoy the ride. Hey, athletes and parents of athletes. So much time, money, and effort is put into the physical aspect of your sport to become the best you can be. But the mental game, it's often neglected and it's just as important as the physical game. 
In fact, it's usually the differentiator between the good and the great athletes. Come and join me in the Confident Athlete Program where you'll learn to control your confidence, develop a powerful mindset, and unlock your full potential. Go to jeffhagey.com slash confident athlete to find out more. I look forward to seeing you there. Hey, some of you may know this, but in addition to my coaching, I've recently joined Geneva Financial Home Loans, a mortgage lender headquartered in Chandler, Arizona as a mortgage loan originator. I've always had a passion for serving others, and now I'm proud to also be a part of Home Loans Powered by Humans. If you're in the state of Arizona and looking to take the next step in your journey, contact me at 801-830-3858 to start the conversation. NMLS number 42056, BK number 0910215, Equal Opportunity Lender.